All right, YouTube, uh, sorry for the shaky and noisy video, but here is, I found three boxes of ammo in my old pickup truck that I don't drive very often. Uh, this ammo has been in a very humid environment for probably the last, uh, I would say at minimum three, uh, maybe five, five years, uh, sitting in a compartment, not sealed in any way. The boxes feel very uh, damp. Uh, you know, I live in the middle of, uh, or southern Indiana, so gets very humid here. This is a steel case Russian ammo uh, exposed to a very humid environment. So let's uh, let's open it up. You can see the box is kind of soft. Uh, you can't really obviously feel it in the video, but uh, let's open it up and see if uh, this ammo still looks like in, if it's in decent shape with all the humidity. So forgive me, one handed here, other hand holding the cell phone. And here, this is a 223 Wolf or WPA uh, military classic ammo. Here is uh, an example. It's pretty good, from what I can tell. Looks like it's uh, plenty good to use. Uh, no signs of any rust, so whatever uh, coating they put on this must be working. It actually looks really good. No issue with using this ammo whatsoever. Let's go on to the AK ammo. It's uh, Tula ammo. Um, probably bought, like I said, roughly three to five years ago. And of course, your 762 by 39. Uh, this one is showing some rust. So maybe a different coating on this, I'm not sure. Maybe this is not polymer coated. I'm sure somebody out there can correct me. Tula head stamp, Walmart special AK ammo, works great of course. Probably from the Barnall factory. Uh, and is showing some rust. Go down a layer here, see if uh, the next layer. Uh, minimal rust, uh, still plenty good to use. Not hesitate to use this ammo in any way. It will still uh, work, I'm sure, just fine and probably uh, perform well, especially in an AK, known for reliability, of course. So that's uh, that's three to five years of uh, humid environment. And oops, like I said, one-handed here. Let's go on to the next one. All right, next up, Tula ammo. Nine millimeter, everybody's favorite caliber, right? Yay. Shot a shitload of this stuff. All right. And this has been sitting in the same place three to five years. High humidity, seasonal temperatures in a vehicle. And everything looks great. Um, no hesitation to use here. No real signs of any rust. Uh, like I said, this is not in a sealed container other than uh, just a regular vehicle compartment. Uh, the vehicle is in a high humidity area, and I don't use it very often. I don't let the vehicle air out, so uh, just a backup uh, vehicle, if you will. So anyways, everything looks good. You can store your ammo in a vehicle from what it looks like and not really have to worry about it as long as it's not submerged in water. So hope this video is helpful to you if um, you do this kind of thing and uh, kind of gives you a real world uh, uh, view at something that's been stored for several years. Thanks for watching. See you later. Bye-bye.